Hi guys, Zed here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is episode 2 of my fancy turntable. If you haven't seen the first part, have a look at the video in this corner. Today, we're gonna wire everything up and with the help of our trusted Arduino Uno, we're gonna command the turntable using Bluetooth magic. Without further ado, let's decipher the schematics together. This is the hardware we'll be using. The animation will help you wire everything correctly. Our NEMA stepper motor is controlled by high current micro step driver, which was dimensioned with future proofing in mind. If later on you decide to go with a bigger motor, everything else would be compatible. Don't necessarily have to use this power source model as long as it's got the same specs. Later on you will see that I actually used a black power brick with the same current output. The command side will be fulfilled by our trusted Arduino Uno paired with a Bluetooth module. The idea is to make a phone app that allows us to control via Bluetooth the stepper motor's parameters. In order to wire everything neatly, I have to prepare all the leads in advance. I used generic DuPont wires for breadboard circuits, which I sleeved and finished nicely with heat shrink. Once we have all the wires, we proceed with routing all circuits as per the scheme I shared earlier. To enable command via phone app, we go on RemoteXY website to create our interface. Here we have to configure our setup. We are using HC05 Bluetooth. An Arduino Uno. We will need two switches one for on and off, and the other for toggling the rotation direction. The slider will be used to tweak the rotation speed. You can copy-paste the code into your Arduino sketch. Please be aware that you will need additional code lines which will do the command side of the motor. Full code available for download in the description. Once you program the Arduino, the last step is installing the power connector. It's time for a demonstration. The app is called Remote XY and is available on Google App Store. All you got to do is add Bluetooth device and it will connect and download interface from Arduino that we just programmed. As you can see, all commands work seamlessly with no lag. Hey guys, this was pretty much it. 
I must say that the turntable worked a treat and we managed to get some very nice 360 footage for my friends. I do agree that the project was quite laborious, but I did all the heavy lifting for you. All you gotta do is take my shopping list, go to the store, pick up the stuff you need, follow the instructions and voila, all the resources you'll be needing are in the description down below. Should you need further guidance, please leave a comment. Thanks for watching and I shall see you next time.